Welcome to Pico Interactive. Our headsets are built with your business in mind. Let's take a quick look at the Pico user interface, also referred to as PUI, you will see in the headset. This may look slightly different from the home screen you see, depending on whether the headset is in kiosk mode or automatically launches into any partner content. Here you will find easy access to the highlights, app library, Pico store, as well as the file manager. The file manager is an area where most of your content will be stored, especially if you are sideloading apps, videos, etc. Your installed apps will be stored in the app library after downloading. To the bottom of the PUI, you will find battery levels, options for Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, settings, and finally, the profile button. Before you can log in, you'll need to make sure that the headset is connected to the internet via your own local Wi-Fi. To set this up, you'll need to locate the Wi-Fi button along the bottom of the PUI. Please choose your network from the list. You will now be prompted to enter in your Wi-Fi password to connect. After entering your password successfully, you will be connected, and you will see a green check mark indicating you are connected to the specified network. Once connected to your Wi-Fi, you may see a notice that there is an update for your device. So feel free to complete this process, as Pico's technical team is always improving the headsets. You are now able to log into your existing account or create a new Pico account if you want to. You don't actually need to create an account or be logged in to use the headset or sideload content and applications. You also won't need additional apps or devices, such as a mobile phone, to connect and set up your headset. Everything is managed through the headset itself, unless it is part of a partner's application. If you wish to download apps from the Pico store though, you will be required to create an account and log in. You can still browse without logging in. Business apps can be found in the apps section of the store. If you do want to create a Pico account, locate the login button on the lower left of the app library or Pico store. You will then be taken to the sign in screen. You'll need to enter your email address and create a password. Once you click in one of the fields, a keyboard will appear. Your email address will be used to verify your account request. We will never use your email address, unless you contact Pico because you've forgotten your password or for other assistance. Once you have filled in the required information, you'll see a notification that the registration was successful. For the last step, a confirmation email will be sent to you. Now you are all set to sign in with the new credentials. There are additional options in the PUI to allow you to take a screenshot or record a video within the headset. These options can be accessed by double-clicking the Pico Home button to bring up this menu. To take a screenshot, press the button with the scissors icon. Then a pair of white crosses appear on the user interface. The screenshot will only take an image if you press the home button, so you are free to navigate within the PUI to get the specific shot you would like. You can also capture a screenshot at any time by pressing and holding the power button and the volume down button at the same time. If you would like to take a video recording within the headset, simply double click the home button to bring up the menu and select the camera icon on the far right. Once you have taken screen recordings and screenshots, you can access them by returning to the main PUI and navigating to the File Manager folder. In the File Manager, you will see this window with three buttons at the top for videos, images and APKs. Select the appropriate button and you will see all your files. You are now all set to get started. Thank you for choosing Pico Interactive. Our headsets are built with business in mind.